Thank you for uh, taking the time to watch a Math Business Online video demonstration. Uh, go to mathbusinessonline.com and you can access our free trial to try the application. Uh, the, today we're going to talk about importing your business data onto Math Business Online. Let's go right up to the toolbar and go to this button here with the little map point with a plus on it. Click on that and let's go navigate to where our data is located. So pick a data set and import the data. Now, as we bring this data in, think about in your Excel spreadsheet, how you're gonna set that data up so that it can work in Map Business Online. All data that's imported into Map Business Online comes in as a spreadsheet. So you have a column for your name. It could be your organization name or contact name. You've got a column for addressing city, state, zip code. All of that falls nicely into these little buckets within the application. Now you can pull over to the next screen and pick what columns are most important for your labeling and what secondary columns you might want to have in a labeling as well. And so we'll pick a few. Type is a good idea. There may be lots of different types or column uh, status that you want to bring in and put on your labels. Then you plot the data. It takes a second to think about it and it'll tell you how many records plotted. Uh, so we've got a few that have bad addresses. Uh, you click done and it puts points on the map and quickly shows you the data window. Uh, the data window is accessible from the toolbar up here at any time, but upon import, it'll automatically present the data window and you can look at how your data looks within Map Business Online. And one of the things you can see here quickly is that there's a symbol that's been assigned, an orange dot, and we have a variety of other symbols that you can choose from and assign, including custom symbols if you'd like to go in and create your own. Uh, we'll just change ours to a green dot and we'll make it a little bit smaller. And then we'll look at the data on the map. We can hover over that data and see the labels that we set up. There we go. There's the two columns that I decided to bring in. Uh, so all of that data is there for, use, your, for your use in Map Business Online. And uh, look for some other video demonstrations for other uh, functions within Map Business Online. Um, thank you very much uh, for taking the time this morning, and uh, we will uh, look forward to